How big of a fantasy boost are you giving Mac Jones right now following all of these reports coming out of camp that says he has gained a better grip on the offense, his deep balls have greatly improved? You know, I would expect just about everything to improve. He, yeah, he'll be better at throwing deep passes. He'll be better at throwing intermediate passes. He should have a better grasp of the offense and just the NFL in general. All of that's going to happen as he gains more years and more experience. But even with that being said, it doesn't mean that he's going to be DFS relevant. Uh, he just So what we're looking for is a team that scores a lot of points. It's not really the Patriots right now. We want a high-powered, through-the-air offense. That's also not the Patriots. We also want mobile quarterbacks in DFS. That's not Mac Jones. He doesn't really check the boxes that we need checked. Is he going to be better this year? Yeah, but is he going to be DFS relevant? I don't think so. I mean, just look in the red zone. At the very least, we want Mac Jones to toss the ball around in the red zone. He ranked just 14th in pass attempts in the red zone. Tom Brady, Josh Allen, 50 more pass attempts in the red zone. I just don't know what world you have to live in to consider Mac Jones over those elite options. I mean, Jeff, you know Belichick's going to protect Jones while he blossoms here. Made the Pro Bowl. Teammates are talking about his intangibles. It's, it's all for <laughs> nice storylines. And, I mean, if you're a Patriots fan, you got to enjoy hearing it. But, like, the Patriots are going to be what they have been, <laughs> what they were last year. They drafted another running back. That's pretty much all you need to know. They already had Damian Harris, Ramondre Stevenson, and they actually drafted another running back. This team wants to run the ball. They want to make the game as ugly as possible, as Spears alluded to. They do not want to throw the ball in the red zone. They got Devontae Parker. I don't even know why they got him. I don't even think they'll need him because he's probably going to get like 70 targets. Mac Jones being better is fine. And look, maybe, look, obviously we're a daily fantasy site. There maybe are matchups here where, you know, you come in the year and, and Mac Jones and Devontae Park will end up as like a nice contrarian stack. But you do not want to go down that route very often. You do not want to be chasing Mac Jones all year in DFS. And you certainly don't want to be starting him in season long. It's just going to lead to disappointment. The volume's not going to be there. This is not the kind of team that's fantasy friendly. I'm not even sure who or what Patriot I would necessarily be targeting this year. I mean, the backfield is a mess. Parker gets injured all the time anyways. Yep. Jacoby Myers, maybe? I don't know. I, I just like the Patriots are a team for fantasy purposes. We're just not going to need to talk much about. We will because, you know, they're in Boston. But.